so many business leaders we work with are exhausted. Part of the reason they're exhausted, there's a maxim that says, where your focus goes, your energy flows. Mm -hmm. And if your focus is everywhere, and your energy is going everywhere, you're exhausted. You, you really are. I mean, so many of the times we meet with a business owner and uh, they'll tell you that when they started their business, they thought this was going to be so great. This was going to be easy. They're just kind of, you know, flow through every day, just loving what they're doing and enjoying what they're doing. And by the time they sit down with a coach, uh, they're telling us how frustrated they are, how exhausted they are, how, how every day they wake up afraid to look at their email, afraid to pick up the phone, afraid to go into the office because there's going to be another fire that they've got to put out. And they're constantly jumping from fire to fire, from crisis to crisis. Now, we'll often, almost tongue-in-cheek, say to a client, uh, hey, listen, our job isn't to help make you a better firefighter. It's to get you to a point where, while there still will be fires that come up, that you have set such intention on what it is that you're supposed to do as the owner of the company, that you've taken the time to establish the priorities, uh, the focus for where you are, to be able to know what you need to put your energy into and what you don't. Uh, one of our jobs, uh, and we certainly love doing this when we work with clients, is help them to figure out how they work on the business while they're working in the business. Uh, I love a saying that you have often said, it's the notion of working through the business and being able to, while doing the day-to-day -day stuff, make sure that you're setting up your business in such a way that your attention are on the things that matter most to you and to the success of your business. I think one of the challenges, you know, I can give you this challenge right now is to say, if you're to look at the next 90 days, the next quarter or the next six months, if you need to, to say, what are the two or three things that if you were to put your focus and energy there, they would yield the most dramatic, the most powerful results for your organization. To stop spreading your energy, trying to put out every fire and to say, this is what truly matters most to bring the change in your organization and to set the example in your organization for how others should proceed as well.